एवरीवन आई एम विशाली वर्किंग एज अ मार्केटिंग ऑटोमेशन कंसल्टेंट एट कोरलियो कंसल्टिंग टुडे आई विल शोकेस यू द शॉर्ट डेमो एंड फीचर्स ऑफ अ वेरी ब्यूटीफुल मार्केटिंग ऑटोमेशन टूल दैट इज पारडॉट पारडॉट इज अ बी मार्केटिंग ऑटोमेशन टूल दैट हेल्प्स यू इन ऑटोमेटिंग ऑल योर मार्केटिंग एक्टिविटीज इट इज अर्स प्रोडक्ट एंड इज नाउ नोन एज मार्केटिंग क्लाउड अकाउंट एंगेजमेंट बी इट ई मेल मार्केटिंग lead capturing website analysis everything can be done with pardot very easily so let's begin pardot login what is the very first screen you will see after the login so login into pardot is as easy as login into your facebook linkedin or instagram account you just have to go to login dot salesforce dot com you will land into this page directly just enter your username and password and you're done after the successful login this will be the very first screen that you will see in pardot if you not able to see the screen go to very left side nine dots and search pardot over here so we have named our account as account engagement you can also customize your the name according to your preferences you can name it as pardot lightning app you can name it as account engagement you can name it as marketing engagement whatever you want this is customizable so let's come on to the screen so this is the dashboard that you will see once log in this is the complete overview of your whole pardot instant over here you will see how many prospects you have created how many conversions do you have how many opportunities you have created what is the marketing calendar how many posts you have scheduled how many emails you have scheduled what were the activities you have performed in the past few week days how many are your active prospects their identified companies everything you will see in this single dashboard coming on to the features one of the most important feature of pardot is email marketing let's have a quick look on to that from pardot you can easily design the emails send the emails to all your leads prospect customers etc whether you want to send one to one email bulk email auto responders drip campaigns everything can be set up in pardot with few clicks let's try click on add email template let's give a name as pardo emails we have to choose a folder in order to like compile our data then the campaign whatever campaign you want to tag this email to your track a type of email either it is a html email or a text email you want to send a list email want to one emails your drip campaigns auto responder accordingly you can select these steps so these are the few options that you have when you are creating the emails from pardot so click on save pardot also offer multiple predefined layouts that you can use to design your emails you can also use html emails if you want if you are a developer you can also design the html email in pardot and you have developer console where you can put on your code and design the email If you are not a developer, if you are like me, a marketer, then you can also utilize the drag and drop feature of simply drag the element and type everything in that. You have the text element, you have the image element, you have the button element, and accordingly you can choose the element and design the email. No hard and fast rule, no custom coding required. Simple drag and drop features. So this is an overview about the Pardot emails. Beside emails, Pardot can also help you in your seo activities easily monitor your keywords your competitors etc let me cancel this this is the keyword part of pardot okay you just have to enter your keyword add your keyword here let's say salesforce implementation 
partners. This is one of our keyword. Type in your websites www.codeleo.com. Any tag if you want to add, and you will be able to create keywords. So once your keyword is added, all these stats will be available in a while. Your Google rank, your Yahoo rank, your Bing rank. What is the monthly search volume of this particular keyword? Where are you ranking? What is the keyword difficulty? What is the last state check? Everything you can see over here in this keyword section. Moreover, this is powered by a SEO monitoring tool, SEMrush. So all the data is fetched from SEMrush directly. Apart from keywords, you can also add your competitors. In the pardon, you just have to click on add competitor. So let's say I am writing your foundation. Although it is not our competitor, it is our sister company. But yeah, just to give you an example, www.colio.org and create competitor. Once your competitor is added, you will be able to see all these that what are the external equity link, what is the page authority, domain authority, link to root domains, what is the last date check. So every time you have a competitor, you can add that in Pardot and you can easily get these simple stats. You do not have to go to your SEMrush, go to your other SEO monitoring tool. Everything can be tracked in Pardot very easily with few simple clicks. So next thing is social media posts. So with Pardot, you can easily post on your social media account. There are standard connectors available in Pardot by which you can easily post. Either it is LinkedIn, it is Facebook, or it is Twitter. Everything can be done. So if you have your existing Pardot account, next is the social media scheduling. If you're highly engaged on your social media platform, then you can utilize Pardot for that as well. You can post on your LinkedIn, Facebook account from Pardot easily. You do not have to go to your Facebook account. You do not have to go to your LinkedIn account separately. Just log in into your Pardot, connect your Facebook account, connect your LinkedIn account, and you can post it. You just have to click on new social media post. Add what account you want to select, your Facebook account, your LinkedIn account. Add your content, insert a link, insert a picture and send now. Your post will be posted on your social media account once successful posted on Pardot. So this is what Pardot can do. Your social media can also be handled from Pardot. Your SEO can also be handled from Pardot. Next is the website analytics. This is one of the best thing about the Pardot. For example, I have a website www.polio.com. So now what I want is anybody who is visiting my website, I want that to be tracked in Pardot. So I have a form on my contact us page. Whoever is filling up this form, I want that data to be captured in Pardot. So let's try if this is happening or not. So this is our contact us page. This is the form. Okay. So this is my email ID. I'll click on send. Now we have two par dot prospects. Search for the email ID that you have entered in the form. And yeah, it's here, like this one. So here you can see this is the form from which I have filled up my information. My page views are also calculated here. What is the first page? I have viewed this is my entry point www.coreo.com. Then I went to talk to us page. Then I went to thank you page. So everything is tracked in Pardot very easily. I was there on the page. I was on the home page for 13 seconds. I was on the talk to us page for 16 seconds. Then thank you page appeared. So this thing is also captured in Pardot. What was the source? I used the Google. This was the natural search. I directly went to Google and I searched for coreo.com. The sources are also calculated here in the Pardot. Now, if you'll see my prospect, 
there is certain score that has been assigned to me let's say i have submitted the form and 50 score has been assigned to me then i have viewed the pages two points has been assigned to me i have opened the email then five point has been assigned to me it's according to your activities you are opening an email and email has been sent to you you are filling up the form you are accessing a file you are opening a social media post everything is scored in part or separately accordingly a score is calculated and you can prioritize your lead you have to attend first and which lead you have to attend at the last this will help your sales rep to convert the leads which lead is more interested in our company this can be tracked very easily using the scoring part of and apart from scoring every single detail has been captured i am an assistant manager i am from digital department what is my phone number anything i am filling up in the form that will be captured here in the pardot so this is one of the most beautiful feature of pardot so this is the form that i have filled that is why my information is here there are certain visitors that are visiting my website but are not filling up the form for those as well, there are analytics that I calculated in Pardot. So today, in the morning, I have 24 page views. There are 45 new page visitors. How many visitors, which page they have visited? Everything is here. What is the source point? What are the first page view? At what time they have viewed the last pages? What was the campaign they are associated with? Then there are multiple features you can filters that you can apply last month for your last year also everything so these are the very small details that are captured i think ever you are showing this to your manager this will be very helpful for you then next part is the reporting with pardot you do not have to create the custom reports and dashboards. There are things happening in Pardot. There are activities you are doing and everything will be created automatically. You do not have to go to your Excel. You do not have to go to your any other tool. Reports will be captured automatically. Let me show you how reports are being captured. Let's say you want to see the email campaign reports for the last month. You can simply go to account engagement reports, click on the emails, and here you will have the complete stats about your every single email campaign that is going from Pardot. This was the first campaign, this was the second campaign, how many cents were there, what is the delivery rate, what was the campaign it was actually associated with. And when you click on this particular report, you will get a detailed report of your email campaign. What was the delivery rate, HTML opens, your click to open ratio, who was the person who have created this email campaign, to which audience it was sent to, how many total sent, what is the bounce rate, what is the deliver rate, every single thing. How many links were clicked, this is our Facebook link, four people clicked on this link. For our homepage, six people click on this link. You can also get details about these people then your click through ratio as well this is your complete email you can easily get which button get the highest click on this button this got 2.2 percent of click this got 2.2 percent again then on home page 1.5 percent of people clicked on this home page button then there are social media icons these many people clicked on my social media icon then there are none who clicked on the unsubscribe link. So every single thing is calculated. Then is the interaction report as well. You can also see what is the percentage of people who actually read your email, how many just skipped the email and how many forwarded the email. This report you can also get in Pardot. On which email client your email is performing well. So let's say on Apple mail privacy, 43% of people are there on Apple mail privacy. Then there are Gmail client also. Then there is Outlook client also. Accordingly, you can create your emails and you can design and accordingly you can render your emails. Let's say I am high volume of my audience is using Gmail. I can create the email according to Gmail configurations. So low volume of my audience is using the Apple mail. I cannot neglect it, but yeah my main focus will be on gmail only so these things are captured in pardot 
apart from the emails social media there are standard connectors available in pardot that will help you in integrating your third party applications let me show you what are the standard connectors available in pardot just have to go to account engagement setting there is a tab for connectors Just click on connectors. Okay. So here in the connectors, you can see how many connectors you have already connected with your Pardot. So my Facebook is already integrated with my Pardot. My LinkedIn is already integrated. So there are two Facebook accounts that I have connected with Pardot. My Google Analytics account is also integrated. My LinkedIn account is also integrated. So everything you will see over here, whatever is connected and whatever you want to connect will be available here. In the ad connectors, there are few more connectors available for webinars. You have go to webinars, you have Google AdWords connectors, you have Slack, you have Vistia. So these are standard out of the box connectors that are available. You just have to log in into these accounts and just connect it. No hard and fast API integration, just the authentication part. Apart from these third party application, there is a standard connector available for your Salesforce as well. So if you have a Salesforce account, you can also connect it with Pardot. What will happen if you integrate your Salesforce account? Whatever data you have in your Salesforce and whatever data you have in your Pardot, both will be synced together and you can plan your campaigns accordingly. If you have 10 leads in Salesforce, then you can sync those 10 leads with Pardot automatically. If you have 10 opportunities, those opportunities can also be synced with Pardot. Accordingly, you can run your marketing campaigns. So these are some standard connectors. There are multiple connectors available. They can be added through your third party applications. This is a very short overview about the Pardot. There are many features that we have in Pardot. We will learn about those features in our next session. In our next session, we will learn about Pardot emails, domains and data in details. Bye bye.